welcome back. I hope you all are having a fantastic day. So I am, if you can't f figure it out, putting out some 4th of July vibes. Happy 4th of July, you guys. I hope you all are having a fantastic Independence Day. Let me know in the comments down below what you're doing today. I am pre-filming this, so I am actually in like blue eyeshadow, red lips, blue shirt. I'm in 4th of July mode a couple of days ahead of time, but that's because, like I said, I wanted to go ahead and pre-film because we do have plans for the holiday. So let me know what you're doing. I would love to hear it. Again, don't forget, we do have the 3,000 subscriber giveaway going on, so definitely head over, check that out, and enter if you have not already. And if you are new, please do go ahead and consider hitting that subscribe button. We would love to have you join our YouTube family. Also, don't forget to leave that comment down below and give the video a thumbs up. I love hearing from you guys. So, as you can see from the description below, we have, yet again, the Grandma in a Box. You guys, this last month was the first month I did this, and this was absolutely amazing. It is so awesome. I love how much fun this is, how creative this is, and just the idea behind this box. For those of you that do not know, Grandma in a Box was started by a wonderful lady named Terry. When her grandkids moved away, she still kind of wanted to be able to give them, you know, those treats that grandmas are known for, you know, cookies or just different things. Um, that when you go to grandma's house, you get. <laughs> well, when you don't live near grandma, what do you do? She started grandma in a box. So she started actually sending the cookies and different things to her grandkids. And then it evolved into this subscription. So the subscription is always a kind of themed, um, fun, activity, if you will, of cookie decorating or, you know, different types of yummy treat crafts, which is really awesome. And everything you need is included. Now, if there are things that you do not need, they are to, or that, I'm sorry, if there are items that you do need that are not included, they are typically items that you're going to have around your house already. Um, like last month, one of the items, we needed a microwave to heat something up. We Everybody has a microwave, you know, like, or most, I would think most people have a microwave. So, you know, it's basically everything you need right here in the box, ready to go, make the treats. So last month was like minions and emojis. And obviously I can tell, let me cover up my dress, but she always puts really cute stickers um, on the box. So... 4th of July, obviously, is the box. So that's why I made sure this went up today. So let's open this and see what a yummy craft snack projects we have for July and July 4th. Like I said, she, she always does like these amazing things. I do want to let you know that this is $20 a month. I will put a link down below. You do get your first month for $10. Um, and then after that, it's $20 a month. And I think it's well worth it. It's something fun, especially if you have kids, grandkids. You know, if you do happen to live near your grandchildren, um, this is definitely something fun. Or even if you want to subscribe to this and have it sent to someone, that's a gonna idea, an idea as well. So when we open it, this is what we see. The Grandma in a Box sticker. Um, all right. And she does always include cards with like step-by-step -step instructions and everything so that is fantastic La and I love like she sends everything pre portioned and everything in these you know like in the little cups the little plastic cups um, so you literally don't have to measure anything or it's just it's there so um, Okay, let's take a look. 
So here is just her card. Grandma does all the work so you can have all the fun. And let's see. Now this is saying to enter 10 off at checkout to get $10 off your first box. Um, monthly subscription box with cookies to decorate and candy treats to make all the fun and none of the work. Which is so true because she does everything <laughs> for you. You just then have the fun of actually doing the project. So we have, that's project number one. Um, this is what I was looking for. All right, so July 2019, Cookies and Candy. Welcome to the July Grandma in a Box. This month we have three new projects, including Sparkler Pretzel Rods, Golden Peanut Bites, and Patriotic Cookie Shapes with Red, White, and Blue Frosting and Sprinkles. I'd love to see how your treats turn out, so please send me some photos. Um, let's see. I am working on some fun beach and summer theme projects for next month. If you already subscribe, thank you. If not, the deadline is August 3rd um, for the next box as we ship the first week of every month. So yes, that is true. They do ship out the first week of the month. Obviously, I'm pre-filming for July 4th and I already have the box. So definitely, if this is something you're wanting, go ahead and sign up so you can get your hands on that August box. I'm sure it's going to be amazing and the thought of beach and all of that I think is going to be so cute. She comes up, like I said, with the most amazing designs and just fun stuff. So um, go ahead and like I said, I will put that link below and get your first box for $10. So let's see what it says on the back. Um, this tells us our contents and everything that is in the box. Um, and then it does tell us what we will need from home. Scissors, microwave, a microwave safe bowl, one knife, one spoon, toothpicks, which are optional, and a paper plate. So it says empty the contents of your box and set the two sheets of wax paper on a table to be used as your placemats. For easy cleanup, make sure you do all the work on the wax paper. So right there, it tells you your contents and then what you need from home. So again, most people have scissors, a microwave, a microwave safe bowl, a knife, a spoon. To I know we have toothpicks. I live in the South. You're going to have toothpicks if you live in the South. <laughs> so there is that. Now our, let me show you guys the box with everything pulled back. Oh, isn't it cute? Okay. So the first project are sparkler pretz, sparkler pretzel rods. <laughs> um, so let's see. This you are going to use these honey wheat, which I love, twist pretzel rods. And then you're going to use the melting chocolate, which is right here. And y'all, it's already like white with a little bit of like red, white, and blue, but I love that it's labeled. So here's your melting chocolate. So you'll heat that up. You'll dip your pretzel rods in to that. And then you have some sprinkles. Let's see. Your choice. Okay, because there's a couple different things of sprinkles in here. So you've got some red, white, and blue sprinkles. So there's your sparkler rods. How adorable. All right, so that is project number one. Um, and then project number two are golden peanut bites. Um, for this project, you'll need the container of pretzel squares, which is right here. The container of peanuts. So here we have some peanuts. And then along with leftover melting chocolate. So there'll be some of this left. So you'll need this. Um, and then these brown paper cups right here. There are six of these. And then your choice of the patriotic sprinkles. So then we'll just grab some regular old sprinkles here. Red, white, and blue. Awesome. And what you're going to do basically is melt the chocolate. Um, you are going to add the package of the peanuts and mix it together. And then you're going to put a pretzel in the bottom of each of the little 
um, papers. <laughs> and then you're going to just drop a little spoonful of the melted chocolate and peanut mixture and then put a little bit of sprinkles or you can leave them plain. How cute is that? And that's probably going to be really delicious. All right, so then our final project are patriotic cookies. So we have some different shaped pre-baked cookies. So we have some round, like with a scallop edge, and then we just have like some, we have two rectangle cookies. And of course, 4th of July, you gotta have some star cookies. So we have two small and two larger star cookies. And you have the red, white, and blue frosting and I love that it's already like this to where literally you just snip off the end of the tip here the bag and you're ready to go to decorate and you don't have to worry about trying to find piping bags or anything it's ready for you and then the final we have two more little sets of sprinkles here we have these beautiful like red sugar crystal sprinkles and then these super super cute red white and blue star sprinkles so there we have that and then she does always include like i referenced the two sheets of wax paper so you don't have to make a mess um or when you make a mess you just do that and it's not all over your counter so those are our three projects so again we have the patriotic cookies and everything we need to do the decorating we have the golden peanut bites which i think are be really good and then the sparkler pretzel rods which will also probably be really good they're always good so that is what we've got for july 2019 grandma in a box like i said i will put that link below i will put that code as well the 10 off but from my understanding if it's your first box you really don't actually even need the code it's just going to be ten dollars after that it is twenty dollars a month so Go ahead, sign up, get your August box so you can get in on the beachy theme for next month and do sign up before August 3rd because that is when shipping takes place. So I hope you all have a fantastic 4th of July. Be safe, have fun, enjoy it, and I will talk with you guys with the next one. Bye.